reporting a startling spike in certain crimes. New at 6, KTVU's David Stevenson spoke with police today about the one thing they say is putting many people at risk. As the summer nears its end, San Francisco police are hoping an alarming rise in crime is coming to a close as well. Police statistics show robberies in the city's Mission District jumped a whopping 74% in the month of August. There's always a somewhat of an uptick in crime like during the summer periods when the days are longer. And police say thieves increasingly went after high-tech, easy-to-steal items. The target of many of these robberies are smartphone users, which police say have replaced ATM customers as easy prey for criminals. ATM robberies, at least in the Mission District, are down. But cell phone thefts are, it, it's one of my major problems in the Mission. Lieutenant Marcota says Mission District Station investigators recently made arrests in a robbery crime spree. We're riding up on people, you know, and pulling either a knife or a uh, a handgun, or in some cases a simulated handgun, and robbing people of cell phones and money. Police with the city's Park Station District say the problem extends to rapid transit. Specifically, uh, people that were holding on to their iPhones uh, on the, uh, the uh, Muni's 38 line were having their phones taken from their hands. Well, like, like just like give me your phone, like that kind of thing. Oh, really? Straight up? Yeah, that's scary. <laughs> The robberies haven't just targeted smartphone users. The owner of this Mission Street store told us they've been robbed three times recently, part of their decision to leave the area for good. Police say the good news is with more patrols on the street, Mission District robberies have since dropped about 20% in the last few weeks. In San Francisco, David Stevenson, KTVU, Channel 2 News. We've reported in recent weeks about the spike in gold jewelry thefts in Oakland. Well, today, police told us that a two-year-old toddler is the latest victim. Officers went door-to-door -door near 47th and Bancraft Avenues, warning residents about that crime. It is at that intersection where police say a mother walking with her two-year-old daughter and pushing her baby in a stroller was confronted by a man and a juvenile this morning. They jumped her, yanked off her necklace, ripped out her earrings, and they grabbed the girl. And her mother got scared because she thought they were going to take the girl. But they took off her gold rings and necklace. Police say women of all ages are being targeted, but especially mothers with children. They also say it appears there are a number of different robbers out there. Secretary